Hello, this is Paul from Quicken Mobile, and right now we are in the Discovery Mobility Warehouse, and we're looking at a P50 lift. Now, one of the things with the P50 lift that we have got a few questions about is having the lift properly situated in the track. So if we look at this cage right here, there's not really any play back and forth because we made a proper adjustment. What we did is we adjusted this, this whole track so we can see the wheels right here. Okay, I'm gonna point that out. We can see that wheel making contact with the track and we can see down here, if we, if we take a look, we can see and see that the bottom wheel is doing the exact same thing. Now, keep in mind this lift has been outside for probably about two months in the weather and uh, all things considered, having this uh, exposed to the elements here in, in Michigan where you get a lot of, um, at this time of the year, snow and then you get rain. Um, without the benefit of being guarded by a roof or anything like that, I'm quite impressed when I open this up and see how good of, of condition this is. But what I want to do here is I want to kind of show, just with a small wrench, okay, all that you're going to do is really, we have this bolt right here, and I kind of, you kind of see how this lets me modify and I'm not going to move but I'm going to modify here where this is going to disengage the pressure for or engage the pressure for this wheel to the side of the track so if I wanted to lift this up you see how that's going to happen there I don't necessarily want to lift it up I've I've got it in the right direction I would just simply lift this up, okay? And you're going to lock these both into the place where you would like them to go. For this wheel to be flush with the actual track. So I, you can see I was able to do that with, with just my thumb and a little bit of an additional tighten up there and you're perfectly good to go. Now, if I took a look at the same token underneath, you see how that's situated? It's exactly the same as the one on the top. We've already adjusted this, and this wheel, you can see, is now making contact with the actual rest of the track. It's not in the middle, um, where if it was in the middle, you would have this portion playing back and forth. So if your P50 lift is too loud or too noisy, if it is, if it has too much back and forth play in the track, really your solution is right here and your solution is right here. Okay, I'm gonna take a look back. I'm gonna back up a little bit. You see the solution on the top and you see the solution on the bottom. This lever will allow you to adjust the actual track of the P50 lift. And when you're done, just close it back up uh, nice and easily. The faceplate, basically, you can kind of see it, it screws on just as easily as you would be able to unscrew it. We have a, a series of other videos that shows the complete and total construction of the lift so you might want to reference some of those videos but as indicated you want the wheel to be to the side of the track and this arm and this arm right here are exactly where you make those adjustments you can continue to adjust until the p50 will provide as smooth of a ride as you would like thank you so much for watching our videos and we hope that you make it a great day